Peace and green blessings. This is a short video on the castor oil plant. The Latin name is Ricinus communis. Now it's very windy out here. The first thing I'm going to show you are the leaves. The leaves are palm or star shaped. They have eight points and they have very large central veins. Okay. Now over here are the flowers. Now the male and female flowers are separate but on the same plant. The female flowers are the red flowers on the top and if you look right below you'll see the cream colored or beige colored um, balls or fluffy flowers. Those are the male flowers. This is called being monoecious. Okay, here we have the fruit. These prickly balls are actually the prickly fruit. They contain what you know as castor beans. Now castor beans are not true beans, they're actually seeds. And inside of each one of these prickly fruits, there are three seeds. As the plant matures, the seed pods actually dry up and they pop in a sense and disperse the seeds up to five meters away from the plant. Next thing I want to show you here are the bright red stems and branches of this plant. It kind of reminds me of bamboo and if you take a look, you can see why. Also, what's noteworthy is that this plant contains one of the most poisonous substances known called ricin. Now, the good thing is the castor oil that we use, which is actually cold pressed from the seeds, is actually obtained in a way that um, makes it safe for us, okay? So, just, you know, when you're dealing with this plant or you see it, do take caution, proceed with caution, respect the plant. Respect the plant and it will respect you. That's my quick video on the castor bean plant. Peace and blessings.